everyone, my name is John Bunka. Thanks for watching the first episode of the Ask Bunka Show. I'd like to just give a shout out to Gary Vaynerchuk for all of his inspiration and all the great content he has. Anyway, let's get to it. Thanks so much. All right, welcome to how to remove your page from the Facebook Business Manager. Um, this is an update video. This is the current video we have right now. And we're getting a lot of questions and feedback that we love, by the way, um, that Facebook has changed things, and they have. Uh, so this video was originally published, uh, wow, this time, uh, last year, so a year ago exactly. So what I mean by Facebook business is if you go to business.facebook.com, um, I'm a part of two businesses, so I'll just select mine, but you should see something similar to this, different stats, different pages. I've removed all my pages uh, that I use from Business Manager, but added a few to kind of walk you through this. Um, so if you have Susan's cat care business, you have bills, plumbing, et cetera, they'll be in here, and I'll show you in this video how to get it out. How you know you're in Business Manager is there's a gray bar at the top when you're editing your pages or posting new updates. If I click over to Facebook here, you'll see to manage this page, I have to go to the Business Manager. So if I click this, it then brings me to same exact look and feel, but now I have a gray bar across the top and I can post updates here. This personally really doesn't work for me. I don't think the business manager lives up to what it needs to if you're a small business. If you have tons of employees and you're larger and you need different permissions, business manager could be the way to go, but I still think it's easier just to do it straight from Facebook. All right, so how to get my FB for business update Facebook page out. I would go up to pages here on the top left, click it. Under settings, it says business manager settings. Click that. It'll then show us the pages that I have in the back end here. So I have three of them. The one we wanna remove is this one right here at the top. So I simply just clicked it. Now this used to be a lot harder as you see in our previous video from last year. But now you simply click remove and it gets the job done. So I hit remove and it says, are you sure? And if you remove it, you won't have access to the business manager, which is what we want. So we're gonna go ahead and hit remove. So now it's been removed and it shows me another page um, that's in here. Now, if I just go to facebook.com, on the left-hand side, you'll have different favorites, um, but you see here under pages, I now have FB for business update which is the one we're talking about. And now I can manage and control this page right into Facebook. Don't have to go to the business manager anymore and I'm done. If you like this video, feel free to thumbs up below. Also, if you have any questions, subscribe and go ahead and ask us in the comments below as well. Thanks. Again, thank you so much for watching our first episode of the Ask Bunka show. I'm John Bunka. Uh, feel free to subscribe below, just down here, click the red button and ask any additional questions that you may have. You may be asking, who is this guy? I'm a WordPress website consultant in Colorado Springs, Colorado. I've just tipped over 300 unlisted videos, and now we're gonna go public with our Q&A and break outside of the answering questions just for clients and answer them more for you guys as well. So thanks again for all the great comments. Thanks again for the likes and the shares, and I look forward to speaking with you. Thanks.